Welcome to the first annual Endo Olympics. It's going to be a big day for the young athletes, so hopefully they all received a good night of sleep and their sleep wave cycle, known as circadian rhythm, controlled by the hormone melatonin, was not off. This hormone is produced by the penile gland, which is a small pine cone shaped mass of glandular tissue found just posterior to the thalamus. Training these athletes was not easy and oftentimes they were reluctant to follow their coach's instructions, but eventually they turned around. Much like how the hormone thalamusin produced by the shelf triangular shaped thalamus helps train and develop T lymphocytes during fetal development in childhood. Our first event of today is weightlifting. All the athletes are pumped and ready to compete. This event requires high levels of calcium in order for bones to rebuild and become stronger as the muscles strain to lift the weight. Luckily, the butterfly shaped thyroid gland located at the base of the neck around the trachea is here to help. Calcium is released when calcium ions levels in the blood reach a certain point. It also functions to reduce the concentration of calcium ions by aiding the absorption of it into the matrix of the bones. Yo, lights out, but I'm on the rise. Everybody's out now, gonna take a time. Doing all the witty things that'll make you smile. Snapshot, take it quick, make it last a while. Do you wanna come and take a little walk with me? Come talk with me, get lost with me. And you know, I wish right now that we don't ever stop this. Because I just don't think we'll top this. Up next, we have tennis doubles, with each team having two people facing each other from their side of the net. Similar to the orientation of the parathyroid, which has four small masters of glandular tissue found on each posterior side of the thyroid. They produce PTH, parathyroid hormone, which stimulates the osteoblasts to break down the bone matrix to release calcium and trigger kidneys to release filtered calcium to the blood. While over at cycling, the competition is fierce as the athletes pull ahead and fall behind, much like the rise and fall of sugar or glucose levels in the blood. Luckily, the referee insulin is there to regulate so they never venture too far from equilibrium. The pancreas produces this hormone and is a large gland located in the abdominal cavity, inferior and posterior to the stomach. Today, we also have the event Taekwondo, where athletes fight each other in order to get the upper hand. These young males have excessive amounts of testosterone produced by the testes, or gonads in males. Females are affected by the estrogen produced by the female gonads, the ovaries. Both contribute to secondary sex hormones in either gender. If I had a chance, I wouldn't be the only one. Unlimited time to find the light and have a little fun. To knock above the rest, unlimited time to test. The booty at composers looking at me nonetheless. Bobby, and I'm like, don't you worry about it. It's not your business. I know exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> 
Unlimited black and white Unlimited time to fight Unlimited reasons that I know that I'm not always right But if I had to wonder if dynamite is always red Then that's a silly question sinking in my silly head So both the road and train Unlimited time to play And if I'm looking close enough I'll face it either way Burst and blades of light I'm urging now and taking flight Unlimited ways to stay the same I know you never change You never change. I know you never change. A new event added to the Endo Olympics is competitive jump roping, where athletes compete to quickly connect chains of jumps. Peptide hormones synthesize similar chains, but with amino acids, which form pro hormones or inactive molecules that are converted into active hormones. Relatively small molecules called amino acid derivatives are structurally related to amino acids. Some examples of these biogenic amines include endopinephrine and noroendopinephrine synthesized in the medulla of the adrenal glands, melatonin and thyroxine. Up next we'll visit the cross. Their league is especially for those who suffer from endocrine disorders such as acromegaly, <laughs> a disorder in adults in which the pituitary gland produces too much growth hormone, gorder or enlarged thyroid, an Addison disease, aka hypocatalysm, a disease where adrenaline glands don't produce enough hormones. Over at wrestling, the athletes are really taking a beating. Hopefully, their lipid derivatives produce leukotrins or leukocytes to coordinate tissue responses to injury and disease. Lipid derivatives are divided into two classes. Ecosonoids derived from arconitic acid, which are small molecules with a 5 carbon ring at the end. They are important paracrine factors that coordinate cellular activities. The other division, steroid hormones derived from cholesterol, are lipids released by the gonads, adrenaline glands, and kidneys. Some examples are testosterone, estrogen, cardiosteroids, and calcitriol. Here we have the event quad frisbee throw, a new sport attempting to be officially added to the Olympics. In this event, the partners must work together for success, much like the pituitary and anterior pituitary. The pituitary gland is a small pea-sized lump of tissue connected to the inferior portion of the hypothalamus of the brain and is responsible for hormone prolactin, which is chiefly used to stimulate the mammary glands. The anterior pituitary is controlled by the releasing and inhibiting hormones of the hypothalamus. It stimulates the release of the hormones thyroid stimulating hormone anticonorptor hormone, follicle stimulating hormone, lutensinic hormone, human growth hormone, and prolactin. All he even wanted to is just be From all this extraneous activity, the young athletes are often left out of breath and low on oxygen. Luckily for them, the kidneys sense this and produce the hormone erythropoietin in response to the low levels of oxygen in the blood. The released hormone travels to the red bone marrow which stimulates an increased production of red blood cells. Track and field athletes especially experience this shortness of breath from the intense running they must do. When interviewing the athletes, some admitted to imagining something easing them in order to secrete stress responses which slow down digestion, increase awareness, and send blood to the brain and muscles in order to make them run faster. This response is produced by hormones released by a pair of roughly triangle glands found immediately superior to the kidneys called the adrenal glands. We interviewed endo-olympic athlete Jose Rosario in order to recount his life struggle with diabetes. He doesn't actually have diabetes, but whatever. There are many different variations of the disease. Type 1, called juvenile diabetes, is a chronic condition in which the pancreas produces little to no insulin. 
In type 2 or adult late onset diabetes, the patient experiences severe symptoms. However, the disease is often self inflicted from health diseases rather than a genetic disposition. A pregnant woman may temporarily experience high blood sugar called gestational diabetes. Symptoms include thirst, frequent urination, hunger, fatigue, blurred vision, and poor wound healing. Other problems stemming from diabetes may include heart disease, eye complications, and kidney disease. What is this? Okay, you fight today. Mmm. Okay, you fight today. Oh, there it is. Oh, there it is. Mmm. I like that move. <laughs>